and it's moving to move on. So I'm going to read the names, and here we go. Your first semifinalist, Soren Chocksky. But I like religion. I like stories. I think the story of Adam and Eve is a beautiful story, you know. But as a kid, I was wondering how bad was the food? <laughs> because God told Adam and Eve they could spend eternity in paradise. Just don't eat one apple. But Adam and Eve were like. Nah, man, we gonna have to eat that apple. <laughs> have you ever had an apple before? Super mediocre, at best. It's a third tier fruit. You can hold out for a mango or a kiwi. My mom gave me an apple every day in elementary school. If there's no peanut butter, I threw that fucking apple away. Your second, Ryan Donahue. People started revealing to me the harsh realities of this life in which we live. Started saying things like, if you want to go get a great job you love, you got to go to college. But I don't know if that's true, because when I was 17, I knew I would love to work in a roast beef place. <laughs> so I went down to a roast beef place, I got an application, and on the application under interest, I wrote, roast beef. <laughs> You bet your sweet ass I got that job, too. Absolutely, slinging roast beef at 17. Not bad, not bad, not bad. Got a job doing okay in the financial circuit. You know what I mean? Best friend on the job, 35. And rounding out the round, Jayong Lee. I always find it hard giving directions. Uh, you have to appear confident, even though you're not sure. Right? Once I was on a train, the person next to me asked, do you know where the dining car is? Yeah, just go straight down to the end of the next passenger car and then take a right. <laughs> so he went, uh, then our eyes met again as he bounced by the window. <laughs> and we laughed together awkwardly. Uh, He died. Uh, uh, uh. Big hand for all the winners tonight. Big hand for all the comedians you see tonight. Thank you guys again for coming out. Please, thank you. Good night.